Hello everyone, my name is Anissa Rizky Ramadoni from 6A And then today I'm gonna talk about slang versus jargon Before it, I'm gonna talk about sociolinguistic What is sociolinguistic? Sociolinguistic is the descriptive study of the effect of all aspects of society Society, including cultural, the way language is used, and society's effect on language. And then, I'm gonna talk about denotation and connotation. Denotation is something written in dictionary and accepted definition of the world. And then, connotation is how the word used in generally by publicator or how it is interpreted to become a private word and now in terms of connotation there are two areas that I want to talk about the first one is slang slang is informal language that is more common in speech than in writing and then for the example and then for the example be my guest means something is okay or it's okay to use something a person owns hey Tom could I, use, could I use the bathroom of course no problem we can use be my guest another example is seven sound you are safe or secure Hey Jerry, how was the flight? Are you already at home? Well, hello Tina. Yay, I'm already here. Oh, we can use all seven sounds. The next one is jargon. Jargon is special word or expression that are used by a particular profession and difficult for others to understand. If you listen to the doctor, then they were talking about the patient and you didn't understand what they were talking about it because they use they using jargon or special language with which is for their profession for example Rhinorrhea, it means runny nose. Auscultation, it means listening to the stethoscope. And then the last one is paripilation, it means goosebumps. Thank you.